crucial meeting of the National Coalition Oversight Committee is expected to con front the fallout between the DA and Action SA on Tuesday. Action SA has taken aim at DA Tswane Mayor Randall Williams over an investment proposal and threatened to resign from his municipal cabinet. But in other parts of the country, a coalition is planning to take over from ANC-run councils. Govan Whittles fills us in. The impasse between Action SA and the DA threatens to shake the coalition governing Tuane, Johannesburg and Ikuruleni. An oversight committee is meant to deal with this. We have had to deal with motions of no confidence in the past, so tomorrow we will have to deal with the uh, possible motion of no confidence that is being put in the mayor of Tswane for Thursday. And luckily the coalition agreement does have the different mechanisms, so we will deal with it. It is an important meeting, it is a difficult one. But one analyst says a legal framework to manage coalitions is required. Those that are going to suffer are our own citizens. And I think it is time that a proper framework has to be followed that must actually regulate how coalitions are supposed to be run and be managed in South Africa. Another analyst says the tension may be about more than the investment proposal. They want to still distinguish themselves from a leading party like the DA, um, and therefore they can't in all respects just simply accept and keep in line with what the DA as, as the leading party in the coalition is saying or what their wishes are. So we are going to see more of that, but that is part of the very essence of coalition governments. Meanwhile, in Nelson Mandela Bay, a new seven-party coalition led by the DA is poised to take power from the ANC's coalition. It's a, a very difficult uh, uh, configuration of party support there. But we've succeeded in, in coming to an agreement. We've signed a coalition agreement between uh, seven, eight parties in, in, in Nelson Mandela Bay. And the process is now underway to bring a motion of no confidence in the current mayor. And I believe that we will succeed in forming such a coalition government. The outcome of this week's meeting is likely to determine the future of Tswane Mayor Randall Williams and could also signal whether other metros are heading for similar trouble. Govan Whittles, Johannesburg.